。尽管公正党在近期周选中接连失利，前财政部部长达因还建议公正党主席安华退位让贤，由拉菲兹引领公正党。但公正党通讯主任法米法兹强调，党选期间没人向安华发起挑战，而党内一众领袖相信，安华依旧是西蒙的粘着剂，应该给予安华机会，带领西蒙迎战全国大选。The room was there.、Mm -hmm. If people speculated that Rafizi wanted to challenge Datu Sri Anwar,、mm -hmm. he could have done that on nomination day. Yeah. But I think Rafizi and all everybody else, you know, myself included, understand that we must allow Datu Sri Anwar this、mm -hmm. opportunity, this chance, to lead the party going to GE15.、Mm -hmm. uh, For various reasons, for many reasons, yeah.、Mm -hmm. I think he is still the glue for Pakatan Harapan. I think he can yeah, still yeah. draw、mm -hmm. strong support, and we need, as I said, to understand that this is where we are at a particular level,、mm -hmm. and we need to go further than that. We need to get more than that. Is、uh, will we will the new leadership line up、mm -hmm. be able to provide the ideas that enables us to tap into? And win over the hearts of the fencers. I hope so.、Mm -hmm. I don't think we're necessarily talking at this point in time about succession, about、uh, someone to replace. There's no right now. There's no discussion in the party about that because the room, the door was wide open. Anyone who wanted to challenge Atul Shyamwa can do so. No one did. So the deputy is not necessarily the. Not necessarily so. Not necessarily so. Definitely, Azmin was not, <laughs> right?